Hello everyone, Frank again for Study English with Us, and today we're going to talk about the English idiom, he's losing it. He's losing it. Let's get started. Have you ever heard this expression, he's losing it? Maybe you heard it at the office, somebody's talking about uh, uh, and maybe an elderly gentleman in the office who isn't performing quite as well as he used to, uh, maybe is forgetful about some things, and um, the joke around the office might be, well, he's, he's really losing it. And what it is a reference to is he is losing his abilities, his memories. He's losing his ability to think clearly and remember things from the past. And uh, so it's all of these things that he's losing. It's what's being referred to. He's losing it. The it is all of those mental abilities that he used to have, they're now fading away. He's losing it. And in English, there are actually a number of expressions that say kind of the same thing. Uh, you might hear somebody say, oh, he's losing his marbles. He's losing his marbles. And basically, it's the same idea. The marbles are kind of referring to the brain cells and they're just not functioning like they used to. The uh, synapses are not firing <laughs> like they used to and uh, he's very forgetful. He might not always remember people's names like he used to. He might sometimes wonder where he is even. Now, sadly, this is a real condition. As people get older, we usually say they get wiser, you know, because they've gone through many life experiences. And so the older people are, the wiser they usually are. However, because of age and uh, the brain cells not working as clearly as they used to, uh, especially in some people who have an actual physical condition, of dementia, we call it in English, dementia, uh, they can really uh, physically lose the capability of operating their mind like they once did. And it can become quite noticeable as you uh, interact with them and realize that they're forgetting a lot of things, they're forgetting their speech, words come difficult, they call people by the wrong names, and it just becomes more and more noticeable and people will say, oh, he's really losing it. And we have to be careful because it is a real condition and uh, we need to respect our elders, right? They have done so much for us. And uh, if we recognize that they are diminishing in their capacity, we need to take steps to help them in whatever way that we can rather than make jokes about them behind their backs, right? We don't want to offend anybody uh, or disrespect anybody by using this phrase, he's losing it. I know, even in my own life, I'm not that old, but sometimes I'll come down the stairs and by the time I get down here, I'll say, now, I came down here for a reason right? Or I'll open the fridge and then I'll forget what it was that I was looking for in the fridge. And so it happens to us all. I asked my doctor about it once and he said, well, that happens to everybody. Uh, people lose their keys and glasses. And, and so don't be too worried if that happens to you. You're probably fine. And if you hear somebody saying to you, oh, you're losing it. <laughs> it's probably not the case, and uh, you'll, you'll be fine. Well, that's our idiom for today. He's losing it, and uh, I 
hope that you found it helpful, interesting, and fun to learn this idiom. Be cautious how you use it. You don't want to offend anybody. But it's good to know what it means. When you hear it on a TV program now, you'll know what they're talking about. All right. Uh, if you uh, enjoyed this lesson, give us a like, subscribe, and follow us on Facebook. Frank Spangler for Study English with Us. So long for now. <laughs>